<laughs> got the XL horns, got the, I would call those medium horns, I got the butt head. I'm out here bright and early, it's like minus 3 Celsius right now, I'm getting some stuff set up. I've got Boomerang Blue locked in the pen because this is something that I had brought up to me probably like a month and a half, two months ago, I was really excited about the idea, didn't really hear much after that, and then boom, they're like, yo, can we still do this? And I'm like, hell yeah, we can. Pretty excited for what's going down today. We have one of the professional lacrosse players from our Calgary Roughnecks team coming out to the Comedy Ranch today. I'm gonna to teach him how to rope the dummy. I'm gonna teach him how to saddle a horse because on April 20th, they're doing a rodeo theme night. And so they're getting Cowboy Cole involved, which I think is pretty sweet. So I'm stoked to do that. So today we're roping with a Roughnecks player. We're saddling horses with a Roughnecks player. It's gonna be rank. We got this jabroni caught. He's getting the call today for the Roughnecks content. But I got him caught a little bit early. I am going to get him saddled up, take him for a ride. Because like any good wrangler, before a shoot, you lope that sucker down. You hold your loop in your right hand, coils in your left. We'll do a quick demonstration. So you have your two pieces of your loop. Those are going to cross over in your palm like that, okay? You want to swing your rope so that you cover your target. So that every time my rope comes over in front of me, I can see him in my loop. Oh, okay. And then it's like a baseball throw. It's a continuation of the swing. You let it go at your target. You just... But we'll do a progression. If you can catch this guy, we'll get you over on this guy and we'll keep moving you down the rope. If you want to stand on this line here, swing. And then when you're ready to throw it at him, it's literally just let it go nice and smooth right at his head. I already lost my there lesson. There you go. There you go. Oh, no. Cool. Yeah, so I should have asked that earlier. We'll get it like that. Okay. And get a good hold on it. There you go. Now throw it right at him when you're ready. Oh, oh man. Ooh, that's so close, man. And now you guys want to try. play some bets? Because this is going on. Come on. Step up a little closer. Yeah. Go. Oh! Roll that over in your hand. All right, a little closer. A little closer. Yeah, right there. You better go on. Ah, oh, okay. And then it's just a continuation. Just throw it right at him. That's pretty cool. Question, question for you. I'm throwing it. Am I releasing it like that or like that? Your hand will be turned over like turned that. over. Yeah. So, so it's kind of like throwing a ball where you throw and kind of finish like that. Oh. Yeah. So it's going. Yeah, that's right. So when that's you get out, yeah, I think I was going the other way. You don't go on. Here we go. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh. Yo! Get smoked. There it is. Nice. My man. Smoked. <laughs> nice job. Yeah. Smoked. And so yeah, stand about here. And the biggest thing is you wanna you wanna look at the base of the left horn, but you wanna make sure that when you're swinging your loop that you cover the width of his horn. Nice continuation of that swing. Just oh. Close. There it is. Oh, that just, I just don't know what. These ropes, I imagine, are much like your lacrosse sticks where it just takes so much time yeah. messing with them, you know? Yeah. With them and... Okay. Oh! Oh! oh that's slick horns! Done. I gotta go sidearm. That was, that was the issue. That's, you kind of go right horn, left horn, you know? That's Boom. it. That's the. Open. Yeah, it's been a good day. Good day of sports. <laughs> You're gonna be sore tomorrow and so many years. A little closer. Oh! Oh! Yeah, there you go. Oh, oh that felt better. Get up nice and close to him. Get nice and close to him. Oh yeah. Oaks. Oh! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> There it is. One more step. Couple more steps. Yeah, dude. Give it to him. Yeah. Oh. Oh. 
I'm tired. Has everybody caught the dummy? Yeah, we're, I think we're good. Wait, He's doing it. Like, oh. Really oh, yeah. Uh, saddle up old boomerang blue. We'll do a little saddle segment. It's your time to shine. Don't make me look stupid. <laughs> First thing about saddling a horse is you want to brush them where the saddle goes. And then you have your pad. I have an F10 Ultra Pad here. It's made from sheep's wool. It's okay. really comfy, isn't it? Yeah, it is. So that'll go. That's going to sit on them right here. So we'll throw it up on them here. And then so we just kind of look and make sure everything's square, make sure the pad's square and whatnot. It's not too far back. It's not too far forward. So we just kind of have a look at everything. Everything looks good. You drop your cinches down on this side. Make sure nothing's gonna get hung up. We make sure that the stirrup's clear. Where are you going, dude? And drop your breast collar down to kind of hang here. Some people don't like to do that. Some people like to leave it up here. If it's not muddy, I'll just go ahead and put it down and it's ready for me to go. Whenever you're kind of coming around the back end of these horses, either swing way wide or like put a hand on their butt, let them know you're here and just stay close to them. Probably gonna take the wide out. If we reach under here, we grab this front cinch here. Um, this one, it goes through the top, through the bottom, and then we just kind of snug it up so that it's not too tight, but if he shakes or something, it's not gonna roll off underneath him. And as a safety hazard too, you want it tight enough. If he was a younger, more green horse, if he were to spook, pull back, do something, the saddle isn't just gonna roll underneath him and then we're in a really bad wreck. That's how we saddle one. Nice. So we'll pull all this shit off them and... Exact thing to like swish and flick all the hair off. Yeah. Kind of like the bend and snap, but not really. Easy peasy. Okay. Where's the front one? And I just reach under. Nice. Right, so we'll do our front cinch first. Okay. And I can just run under here and get it. Yeah. So if uh, if you want to kind of kind of like what we talked about, uh, keeping an elbow on them all the time. If you want to kind of just run under them like this, and then this way you kind of have body on them. If you were to do something, okay. you can use your body to push off. From okay. Go the wrong way. Go the wrong way. And then yeah, run it through that bottom. Perfecto. Sweet. And then yeah, kind of snug it up a little bit tight on them. And to get that slack out, you just grab it here and you pull on that. Okay. We'll get the back cinch. That one's a lot easier. Pull that breast collar around and you, you got him saddled. Dang, it is too bad you guys didn't bring a jersey. We could have got some cool pictures of him with Boomer yeah. and a lacrosse stick. <laughs> <laughs> From the barnyard. Thanks, buddy. Boom. Oh, that looks pretty good. Nice. Nicely done. Thanks for the help. Nicely done. Rank. Get on. Okay, get Yeah, dude, that guy swung a pretty damn good loop, but I kind of figured he would, man, like a lacrosse player. They got those good wrists, you know what I mean, dude? Like, so I kind of figured once you showed him, he would get it figured out, and sure as shit, he roped all three dummies. That was rank, shout out Zach. Professional lacrosse player, can also rope. Had a freaking blast. Show him my world. Show him what Boomer has to deal with all the time, which is me. We have fun, don't we, Boom? You're getting to be quite the little superstar here, Boomerang Blue actor. You've appeared in a couple cool things now. You've been in a Lone River Ranch Water content shoot. You've been in a Cowboy Shit content shoot, and that commercial actually aired at the CFR, dude. So that was pretty badass. Starting to actually earn your keep around here a little bit, bud. And now you're gonna be in some Calgary Roughnecks. Dude, you are just, what an absolute star. Superstar. Oh, son of a gun. F10 Ultra Pads, get yours. Use the code on the screen to save $50. Don't be a d save your horse's back.